two, ready for push. American 11 Heavy, thank you. Monitor ground point nine, November skirt. We got November, good day. American uh, 11 Heavy, Boston ground. Gate 32, you're going to wait for a sob to go by, then push back. After the sob, clear to push, and we're going to need four right today, American 11 Heavy. Okay, you American 11 Heavy, I uh, understand you need the Alpha, Roger, push back uh, after the sounds approved. Okay, uh, yeah, what I said was uh, after, um, we're going to need uh, runway 4 right today, American 11 Heavy. Oh, American 11 Heavy, Roger, plan on one. USAO 6400 change your instructions is going to be Kilo Sierra and then Alpha. Kilo Sierra Alpha, USAO 6400. Eagle 880, where you parked? 880, South East. Golden uh, 5985, ground point 75. Eagle 880, uh, taxi to one way, four left via Bravo and uh, Whiskey. Bravo, Whiskey, four left, Eagle 880. USA 1995, unfortunately, you have a wheels up time of zero one time now is four seven, so just hold right there, remain this frequency. USA 1995, roger. Vivid 6252, Boston ground, give way to America West, then push back. Give way to America West, and push, Vivid 6252. United uh, 211, hold short of runway 4 left and monitor tower on frequency 138.8. 28.8, short of 4 left, United 211. November for Bravo 12. USA 2990, Roger Taxi via Kilo, Sierra, and then Alpha. Kilo, Sierra, Alpha, USA 2999. Delta 767, tow on Alpha Taxiway uh, for gate uh, 31. Roger, Delta 767. The uh, US Airways 73. Air Shuttle 710, Boston Ground, thank you. Taxi on Alpha Taxiway. Alpha Air Shuttle 710. Delta 9930, taxi. And Delta 9930, runway 90, taxi via Kilo Sierra, hold short of runway 4 left. Delta 9930, taxi runway 9 kilo, Sierra hold short of runway 4 left. Eagle 880, hold short of 4 left and monitor the tower 128.8. Deep 480. 880. Thank you, 141 is clear. Thank you, 141, Boston ground. Give way to the air shuttle regional jet, the America West regional jet, then straight ahead. Runway 33 left, Lima to the ramp. Give way to America West Express and then Lima to the ramp. Thank you, 141. Crash truck 49 on grateful left. Sugar 4911 Boston Ground, the rigid taxi via Kilo Sierra and Alpha. Kilo Sierra, Alpha, Stuck 4911. Air Shuttle 710, as you turn into the ramp, caution for Dornier outbound. He's on the pushback, no factor. Okay, we'll use caution to the ramp, Air Shuttle 710. And USA 6400, right turn on Sierra, join Alpha, ground point 75 now, please. Sierra Alpha, ground point 75, USA 6400. USA 2999, Kilo Sierra Alpha, what is your gate? Kilo Sierra Alpha, we're going to Bravo 12, 2999. Thank you. American 11 Heavy, taxi November. Okay, American 11 Heavy, just hold right there, and we'll be shortly. Alpha, 62, what if taxi? Very 6252, you're going to wait for an air shuttle regional jet to inbound, and I'll have taxi for you momentarily. Where is the inbound? He's around the corner, just hold your position. Actually, you got him blocked. Uh, break, air shuttle 710, hold short of the alley. Only short now, air shuttle 710. Blue Ridge uh, 6252, runway 9 air, taxi via Kilo Sierra, hold short of runway 4 left. Kilo Sierra, hold short 4 left, Blue Ridge 6252, sorry about that. American 11 uh, Heavy, you're going to give way to the Donia and the regional jet on the opposite side. Uh, taxi to the Bravo hold point via Kilo Bravo, expect to run away fall right for departure. Okay, uh, to the Bravo hold point after the uh, regional jet and the Dornier, uh, American 11 Heavy. And should I go 49 11 at Foxtrot, join Alpha Taxiway. At Foxtrot, 20 Alpha, stock 49 11. FedEx 3601 Heavy, taxi to the Bravo hold point via Kilo Bravo, expect to run away 9 for departure. Bravo hold point, Kilo Bravo, runway 9, FedEx 3601 Heavy. FedEx 3601 Heavy, monitor tower now, 128.8. 128.8, Bravo 
2844 USA 2999, right turn Sierra, join Alpha, ground point 75, now please. Sierra Alpha, ground point 75, 2999. Canada 765, taxi. Should I go 4911 at Charlie, gonna give way to the American opposite direction, then continue um, Alpha taxiway in ground point 75. Keep waiting, American ground point 75, check 411. Canada 765, taxi. Hey, Canada 765, thank you. A runway 9, taxi via Kilo Sierra, hold short of runway 4 left. Sierra, short of 4 left, or Canada 765. Well, 939 is clear to the left. Eagle uh, 939, Boston Grand. Oh, where are you parking, sir? At the gate. Eagle 939, uh, Roger. Taxi via Kilo, Charlie, and then Alpha at Charlie, give way to American. Kilo, Charlie, and Alpha, we'll go to American 939. Eagle uh, 790, Boston Grand, uh, where are you parking? Ramp. Eagle 790, Roger. Taxi via Kilo and uh, Bravo. Press Kilo Lima there. Kilo Bravo. Uh, Thanks, 790. For uh, Redick, that's your 377. Okay, Kilo Lima, that's your 3 Hey, Canada, 765. Hold short of Alpha Taxi. is going to be helicopter traffic landing in front of you on uh, Kilo and Lima. Port of Alpha, Canada, 765. Blue 6252. Hold short of left monitor tower 128.8. Short 28, Blue 6252. Eagle, um... 939, are uh, you going to also give way to the Blue Embryo Jet at Alpha Taxiway? Well, okay. Delta 1043, heavy Boston van, gate at 28, push back your discretion. Delta 1043, clear to push, put them in. Delta 2435, Boston van, give way to company behind you, then push back. Delta 2435, give way to company behind us, then we're clear to push. And exit 377, text. Exit uh, 377, please contact the gate hold uh, clearance delivery first on 121.65 so I can get your paperwork. Okay, 2165, sir. Ground flex at 238 with you. Flex at 238, Boston ground, uh, taxi. Uh, flex at 238, okay, where are you parked? We're going to Signature, we're supposed to follow that uh, American Eagle in front of us. Okay, you're going the wrong way. Turn right, uh, actually make a 180 on uh, the taxi with you. Make a 180, please. Uh, 180, we're going to Signature. That's correct. Signature's on the other side of the field, so make that 180 right now. Okay. We're 6802, we're on November, uh, no gate yet. It's uh, 6802, uh, Roger. Give way to a Learjet, left to right on Kilo, then taxi via Kilo Charlie Alpha. Kilo Charlie Alpha behind a Lear, USA 6802. And flags are 238, and now go straight ahead on Kilo Taxiway, all the way to the end. Signature is now on the north side of the field, sir. Oh, okay. Thanks, sir. And American 11 Heavy. I'm going to have to give you uh, Sierra and then Alpha to the Bravo hold point. So just hold short of Sierra for now. Hold short of Sierra, American 11 Heavy. Number 6159, with you. Good morning, Blue 6159, with you in November. Blue 6159, Boston Ground. Taxi uh, via taxiway. Kilo and uh, Quebec hold behind the Delta 737. Kilo, Quebec, and behind the uh, hold behind the Delta 737. American 11 uh, Heavy, giving way to that embryo off your right. Uh, turn right on Sierra Alpha Kilo 1 Bravo to the Bravo hold point for now. Expect four right. Okay, we copy. I'll uh, expect four right. Mark one. Kilo, back to you, Kilo, okay. And Ali. Here, Canada 765, continue outbound now via taxiway Kilo, Sierra, hold short of runway 4 left. Sierra, short of 4 left, Canada 765. Exit 377, you're going to give way to a Learjet that's inbound, and then you can uh, taxi outbound to runway 9 via taxiway Kilo, Sierra. Sequence yourself on a Delta 737 outbound off your right. Okay, behind the Learjet, uh, taxi to runway 9, Kilo, Sierra, we'll be looking for the uh, 737. 337. Adigini 3948, left turn on Kilo, Charlie Alpha, please. Kilo, Charlie Alpha, 3948. Ground level 2435, taxi November. United 505, Boston ground, uh, gate 14 in the alley, wait for Delta, then push back. Behind Delta, clear to push, United 505, Charlie 14. Northwest 157, Boston ground, push back approved. Push approved, Northwest 157. Delta 2351, Boston ground, uh, wait for company 737 behind you, and then push back. Behind the uh, company, and we'll push out 2351. American 11 Heavy Taxi to the Bravo Hold Point. Continental is waiting for you. Monitor Tower 128.8. Expect runway far right. Thanks. 288, we'll expect uh, far right and uh, Bravo Hold Point. American 11 Heavy, Boss Tower. Taxi 2, runway far right via Bravo and monitor the tower 119.1.
Exit to four right uh, via Bravo and a 19-1 American 11 Heavy. American 11 Heavy, Boston Tower. Good morning. Move right up two holes short of four right. After departure, maintain 3,000. Really short of four right, uh, 3,000, American 11 Heavy. U.S. Air 1995, Boston Tower. Uh, advise them you have the numbers. Position to hold niner. Hey, position hold runway nine, and we're all set to go, U.S. Air 1995. Thank you. American 11 Heavy. Runway four right, taxi into position, hold traffic departing nine air. Four right position, hold American 11 Heavy. You gonna go right over the Saab or can I go with the Heavy? Observe release, Thank you, American, American observe release. Uh, heavy TC. USA 1995, traffic holding on the crossing runway, runway nine air. Take off. Runway Niner, clear for takeoff, U.S. Air 1995. Eagle 603, left turn, hold short of four left, landing traffic. Short of four left, Eagle 603. Eagle 603, use cars for the construction equipment, monitor tower 128.8. Short left, 28, Eagle 603. American 11 Heavy, traffic's orbiting north of the field at 3,500 feet, maintain 3,000, runway 4 right, cleared for takeoff. Okay, 3, clear for takeoff on 4 right, what are the winds? Wind 330 at 9 air. The U.S. Air 1995, contact departure. Departure is 1995. United 93 delays off the airport, less than one five minutes. Monitor this frequency for changes. Let me know when you're ready for the push. Monitor this frequency. Call you for push, United 93. Bravo, push. Two nine five Bravo, short of Mike here with Delta. I'm sorry, Bravo, short of Mike. Give me that call sign one more time. It's Garbo. It's Continental 842. 79 Continental uh, Romeo Bravo, ready to taxi. Continental 842, I got you, Bravo, short of Mike. Give me who's calling again at uh, Romeo Bravo? Is that Continental 1179? Primitive. Thank you. Continental 842 at Bravo Short of Mike, monitor ground 121.8. He'll call you when he's ready. Okay, we'll monitor 21.8 today, Continental 842. Continental's 1179, you monitor ground 121.8. He'll give you a call. American 11 Heavy, contact departure. That traffic's now in your 10 o'clock and 2 miles, 3,400 feet. We have a sign of the along American 11 Heavy. Roger, good morning, American 11 Heavy with you passing through uh, 2,000 for 3,000. American 11 Heavy, Boston departure radar contact, good morning. Traffic 10 o'clock, 2 miles, maneuvering Cessna Skyline, VFR 3,500. Yeah, inside American 11. Roger. Cross 76 on station, sir. Cross 76, Roger. There will be multiple aircraft departing runway 4 right and left. They'll be all restricted below you at 3,000 feet. If you have no objection, they won't be making any traffic calls on the uh, aircraft departing. No objection, sir. Any chance of getting 27 to this one? Ross 76, I would give that to you. However, we're using the uh, frequency in another sector. Okay, thank you, sir. User 1995, turn right heading 200. And 200 is 1995. American 11 Heavy, climb and maintain 8,000. 8,000, American 11 Heavy. American 11 Heavy, turn right heading 180. 180 American 11 Heavy. Bye. 
departure code United 175, United 175, monitor ground, Point Niner, he'll call you Oscar's current. Point Niner will get Oscar, United 175. United 175, Boston ground, gate 19, first pack approved. Pack approved. United 175. Eagle 933, Boston ground, taxi to the Bravo hold point, expect runway 9 for departure. Uh, Bravo, hold point at 944, 933. Continental 683, monitor tower on the one. American 11 Heavy, climb and maintain 14,000. 14,000, American 11 Heavy. Delta 2435, climb and maintain 6,000. 2435 up to 6,000. American 11 Heavy, turn right heading 220. 220, American 11. Roger, good morning, Air Canada 765. Is this you leaving uh, 1,200 for uh, 5,000? Air Canada 765, Boston departure radar contact traffic, 10 o'clock, 6 miles southwest bound. Company uh, Canada Regional Jet Station of 8,500 for 6,000. 765. Delta 2435, turn right at 200, climb and maintain 7,000. Delta 2435, right 200, 7,000. Hey, uh, this is Plymouth. Quantit approved on U.S. Air. He hasn't checked in yet. If you still got him in Delta 2435 oh. also. Both okay. Change. All right. U.S. Air 1995, contact Boston Center, 128.75. Good day. 2875, it's 1995. Kogan 5966, traffic no factor, climb and maintain 4,000. Contact Boston approach, 118.25. Good day. 18 a quarter, go 59, 66 here. American 11 Heavy, turn right heading 270, contact lost on approach, 127.2, good day. 272 and 270, American 11. American 11 Heavy with you passing through 10,000 and 14,000. American 11 Heavy, boss, approach flighting 270. 70, American 11. Contact Boston Center 133.42. B342 is long, America 11. Boston Center, good morning, American 11. With your passing through 11000 for 14000. American 11, Boston Center, good morning, climb and maintain flight level 230. Proceed direct Chester. 230, direct Chester, American 11.
November 0, Victor Whiskey, climb maintain, level 240. 240, Victor Whiskey. Digit 332, descend to maintain, level 180, say indicated speed. Hit on the 180 and we're doing 280 right now, because it's at uh, 332. Northwest 206, uh, leveling, flight level 190, check them out. Northwest 206, Boston, Tennessee, indicated speed. Uh, right now, 3.10. Right. American 11, contact Boston Center, 127.82. 3782 is long, American 11. Boston Center, good morning, American 11, with you, passing through 190, 230. American 11, Boston, North Center, Roger, climb maintain level 280. Please zero, American 11. FedEx 32.58, you were clear direct to uh, Barnes. Direct to Barnes, FedEx 32.58. Uh, Delta 24.33, roger, plan runway 4 right. It's 175 to taxi. United 175, uh, taxi uh, B runway 9, taxi via Kilo, Sierra, hold short of 4 left. Kilo Sierra, hold short of 4 left for runway 9, United 175. Northwest 157, vehicle will cross left to right on uh, Charlie in front of you. Northwest 157 inside. Eagle 603, uh, expeditiously to South Cargo, please. Thanks, we'll hurry up. Kogan 5951 is going to be runway 4 left. American 11, climb maintain for level 290. 290, American 11. I want you to go straight ahead on uniform, right turn on whiskey, shorter Sierra. Contact tower there, 127.85. That ATR is working out an issue there, sir, so uh, use caution. Okay, uh, we're going to get a uniform right on whiskey, and then we'll go to tower. Continental 1078. Flow Continental uh, 1592. I don't remember if you told me to call the push or taxi, but we're ready to push. Okay, sir, let me know when you're ready for the taxi. Okay. Continental 1078. United 93, gate 17, for push for Delta. United 93, delays off the airport are uh, actually pushback's company's discretion. Let me know when you're in for the taxi. Okay, uh, pushback company discretion, call you for taxi. Hey, USA 1973, we're ready to taxi off of gate 37. U.S. Airs 1973, understand you're ready for the taxi, is that correct? Yes, sir. All right, monitor ground 121.8, he'll give you a call when he's ready. Hey, 21.8, so Delta 289, push past company's discretion. Let me know when you're ready for the tax. Who else is in there? Continental 1167, first call to Atlanta with Delta. Continental 1167, you're at Romeo Bravo? Check. And you're ready for the taxi for Continental 1167? No, 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 it's the first call to Atlanta. All right, delays off the airport less than one five minutes. Monitor this frequency for changes. Let me know when you're ready for the push. 1167. Who else is down there? 2A Charlie Golf, that's a security detective. 2A Charlie Golf, runway 29. Taxi via. Track 11 traffic set at uh, 2 o'clock, 2 0 miles southwestbound, MD 80, 310. Track 11, Roger. Boston Ground pushback approved. A Canada A29, Boston Ground pushback approved. Track 29 pushback. And uh, American 737, continue on Alpha Taxiway, uh, full shot of Fox. United 175, heavy hold, short of runway 4 left, monitor tower 128.8. 128, hold, short of 4 left. United 175, heavy, boss, yep. Yeah. Rough, sir, United 175, heavy. United 175, heavy, maintain the taxi speed for me. I got traffic on about a two-mile final. Cross the numbers of 4 left at Sierra, and then monitor 119.1. 191, good rate of cross. 191, good rate of cross at Sierra, United uh, 125, heavy. Thanks. United 175 Heavy, taxi in a position, hold Niner. Hold runway Niner, United 175 Heavy. United 505, contact departure. 505, FedEx 3258, contact Boston Center, 125.57. 125.57, thank you, FedEx 3258.
American 11, turn 20 degrees, right? Any right, American 11. American 11, no climbing table level 350. United 175 Heavy, runway 9 are cleared for takeoff. Traffic's holding a position on 4 right. American 11, Boston. Air 7, Mike Lima, how do you hear? Mike Lima, had you loud clear? American 11, Boston. American 1-1, one, one, uh, the American on the frequency, how do you hear me? This is uh, Adam. This is Boston. I turned American 20 left and I was going to climb. He will not respond to me now. Oh, at looks all. like he's turning right. Yeah, I turned him 20 right. Oh, okay. And he's only going to, uh, I think, 29. Okay. Hello? Sure, that's fine. Uh, but he I'm won't not answer to him. He's Nardo. Roger. All right. Thanks. Seven Mike Lima, descend at pilot's discretion, maintain by level 240. PD on 240 will begin down through Mike Lima. American 11, Boston. American 11, if you hear Boston Center, I dent. Boston Center, Roger, climb maintain for level 310. Climb maintain for level 310. American 11, if you hear Boston Center, I den, please, or acknowledge. American 77 is ready to push off gate 6026. American 77 off your right side to company 27 coming into the gate. That's the only thing I've got over there. Reference that, you're cleared for the push, and it'll be a west taxi. You don't need to call me back, I'll just keep an eye on you. When you're ready to go, move up to spot 82 and the ground controller is 21-9. Take care now. Okay, American 77 understands. Clear to push, don't bend the 72 and taxi up to the spot point nine, American 77. Well put. American 11, if you hear Boston Center, uh, recontact Boston Center on 127.82. That's American 11, 127.82. 2875, 780 kilo. All right, Joseph. Warning area is cold. Vicky 3355. You'll be the only guy you get. I assume they're going to call Center as a heading from San Diego. Attention, John. Here's the map of Starkus. Sign in, have fun. American 11, American 1-1, one, one, Boston. Delta 1149, contact Boston Center, 125.57. 1149, 2557, good day. American 11, if you hear Boston Center, ride down, please. Center, Flexia 420, second in, passing 18 for 230. Flexia 420, Boston Center, Roger, climbing table level 240. Climbing to 240, Flexia 420.
7, Mike Lima, contact Boston Center, 128.2. 3.2, Number three in the back, um, the cockpit's not answering. Somebody's stabbed in business class. And um, I think there's mace that we can't breathe. I, I don't know. I think we're getting hijacked. Which flight are you on? Flight 12. And what seat are you in? Ma'am, are you there? Yes. What, what, what seat are you in? Ma'am, what seat are you in? We're a we just left Boston. We're up in the air. I know. We're what? supposed to go to L.A. and the cockpit's not answering their phone. Okay, but what seat point. are you sitting in? What's the number of your seat? Okay, I'm in my jump seat right now. Okay. At 3R. Okay, you're the flight attendant? I'm sorry, did you say you're the flight attendant? Hello? Yes, yes. hello? What is, what is your Hi. name? Hi. You're going to have to speak up. I can't hear you. Sure. What is your name? Okay. My name is Betty Ong. I'm number three on flight 11. Okay. And the cockpit is not answering their phone. And there's somebody stabbed in business class. And there's, we can't breathe in business class. Somebody's got mace or something. Can you describe the person that you said someone is what in business class? Um, I'm, I'm sitting in the back. Somebody's coming back from business. If you can hold on for one second, they're coming back. Our, our number one is, got stabbed. Uh, our cursor is stabbed. Um, nobody knows who stabbed who, and we, we can't even get up to business class right now because nobody can breathe. Uh, our number one is, is stabbed right now. Okay. Uh, and and our number five, our first class passengers, our uh, first class uh, galley flight attendant, and our cursor has been stabbed. And we can't get a the cockpit. The door won't open. Hello? Yeah, I'm taking it down all the information. We're also, um, you know, of course, recording this. Um, at this point... This is operations. What flight number are we talking about? Flight 12. Flight 12. Okay. No, I'm we're on flight 11 right now. This is flight 11. Flight 11. I'm sorry, Nidhi. Boston to Los Angeles. American Airlines emergency yes. line. Please state your emergency. Hey, our number one is staff, staff and our five is staff. I am staff. monitoring a call in which flight 11... The flight attendant is advising our reps that the pilot... Can anybody get staffed. up to the cockpit? Can anybody get up to the cockpit? Flight 11? Yep. We can't even get into the cockpit. We don't know who's they up there. They can't get into the cockpit is what I'm hearing. Okay, who's this I'm talking to? Well, if they were oh, crews, they would keep the door closed. At the Raleigh and I'm the I'm sorry? Specialist on duty. Would they not maintain a thorough... I'm sorry, what was your name again? I think Nidia. the guys are up there. They Nidia. might have gone their, their way up there or, or something. Gonzalez, Nobody G-O-N, can call the cops that we can't even get inside. Raleigh Reservations. Okay. I've now got a you... flight attendant on the line with one of our agents. Okay. And she's calling how? Through reservation. Is anybody still there? The yes, we're contact. still here. Okay. I'm staying on the okay. line as well. Uh, okay. Uh, Hi, who is calling reservations? Is this one of the flight attendants or who? Who are you, hon? She gave her name as Betty Ong. Betty Ong? I'm number three. I'm number three on this flight. You're the number three on the flight? Yes. And this is flight 11? From where to where? Flight 11. Have you guys called anyone else? No. Uh, Somebody's calling medical and we can't get a... Good morning, United 175, that is... uh,
Athens is Rockdale. A couple things. Point out north and west of Rockdale is in San Francisco, 96. What out of prison. Hey, also, are you trying to get through the company on the American or anything? We're trying everything here. Is he really got no transplant to screw up or what? It appears that way. No kidding. Hi. Right. that's taken over. We have just put him in direct Watertown, Jamestown. Last we knew, he was on present heading, cleared to flight level 290. No one is talking to him. Eric has been called. We broadcasted on guard. We've tried through company. Okay, thanks. And 290 is not verified. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. Yes. Yeah, we've taken the American back because he appears to have turned. Yep, thanks. Flagship 5616, boss. Oh, sorry. Do what? 230, flagship 5616. Over it. Go ahead. Yeah, I need you to look west of Albany, American 11, and put him on your scope. He is, uh, Nordo has been since he talked to Boston High. We assume he's at flight level 290. Uh, we're not sure. We think there's someone in the cockpit with him. Um, we broadcasted over guard. We've gone Eric. We have yeah, gone company. Uh, nobody is talking to him. We don't know where he's going. We don't know what altitude he's at. Okay. Got any contact with anybody? Okay, I'm still on with security, okay, Betty? You're doing a great job. Just, just stay calm, okay? We are, absolutely. Okay, we're contacting the flight crew now. We're all con uh, we're also contacting ATC. Okay. Anything else from the flight attendant? Um, so far what I've got, the number five flight attendant's been stabbed, but she seems to be breathing. The number one seems to be stabbed pretty badly, and she's lying down on the floor. They don't know whether she's conscious or not. The other flight attendants are in the back, um, and that's as far as I know. It seems like the passengers in the coach might not be aware of what's going on right now. These two passengers were from first class. Okay, hold on. Hey, Betty, do you know any information as far as the gentlemen that are in the cockpit with the pilots? Were they from first class? They were sitting in 2A and B. Okay. 
they are in the cockpit with the pilots. Delta 1043, climb maintain flow with 390. 390, Delta 1043. United 175, I'd like to request 310 if it's approved. United 179, you say you want 310? Sir, if it's approved, United 175, heavy. United 179, maintain uh, flight low flight flight correction. United 175, maintain flow with 310. 310, United 175, we'd like to see you. Back in New York, Boston. Uh, I got a little situation with American 11, American 11. He is a uh, 767 departed Boston going to LAX. Uh, we don't know where the aircraft is going. He uh, is uh, supposedly going to LAX. Uh, was going westbound. We lost his uh, frequency. Then we lost his transponder, and now the aircraft is uh, just west of Albany, heading due south. Oh my goodness! Okay. We have. Do we have the, uh, the data block on him? Who's got the? Yeah, we. we yeah, we're, it's a primary target presently, and, and it's just heading uh, southwestbound. Okay. Um, Understand. I'll go to right now. I'll, I'll advise the area. The last altitude that I observed was uh, flight level 290. 29. Heading southbound? Heading southwestbound. He's like towards uh, Hancock, uh, right, uh, right around there. He's uh, southwest of Albany by one five miles. You have no idea where he's going? No idea, sir. All right. You can tag him on the uh, TSC. You I have to pick him up. Primary only? Primary only. Okay. We'll okay. Watch him. Thank you. Hampton, Cameron, 39. Hey, Boston Air. How you do me a favor, see if you have an American 11 on your frequency. If you haven't put them on me here at both sides. Okay, I'll try them. Thank you. Well, Boston Center claims that uh, uh, they Boston lost radio transponder. communication with the aircraft and, transponder. and the transponder. And it's also, uh, it, it, they're tracking the primary target at this point. He was last known at uh, flight level 290. Uh -huh. And he appears to have turned uh, south south westbound. And uh, also, there was some mention of some sort of a, a threat being made. or uh, he made? A threat to the cockpit or some threat oh, in, shit. Let me get in, in the cockpit then. And, Boston's uncertain exactly what was said. I guess they're going to try to pull the tapes okay. as quick as they can. Hey, uh, Tom, what can I reach you back? What number at? Um, okay, all right. Okay, I'll call you back. Thank you, sir. 583s with Jetta 20 and a half for 310. You say 583 Boston, said Roger. Contact Boston, center 135.32. 3532 now, blue 6126, well. Rate 76 golf, contact Boston, center 135.32. 3532, 876 golf, yeah. You heard that, John? We're doing 20 to Charlotte, 20 to Atlanta. We've got a bunch of Atlanta, so hopefully they're right. Right. just about done. Why you start at 20? That hasn't been a problem. Rock down 30. Continental 683, contact New York, center 127.17. 717, go 683, see you. They're gone. He can go. He's over Sparta. We heard about him. He stopped at 31. I guess he's no factor with him, though. Uh, they're gone. He might be a. That's the only. I don't know what you want to do there. He keeps going south, though. He'll go behind him, so. And, uh,. And that's it. All right. All right.
Nobody moves, please. We are going back to the airport. Don't try to make any stupid moves. Lexia 420, contact uh, New York, San uh, on one, two, stand by, Wayne. And uh, Jetland 4220, uh, contact New York, San on 127.17. I'm sorry, Flex Jet 420, Connor New York Center, 127.17. 127.17, Flex Jet 420, so on. Delta 351, contact New York Center, 13, correction, 127.17. 2717, Delta 351. USA 583, climb and follow follow 350. Cape Drake on uh, 350, USA 583. Cape Drake on? Yeah, hi, uh, are you uh, able to, uh, are we able to stop the Otis on this line? Um, I'm not sure, but if, I need, if you need to get in touch with them, I can, uh, right, I, have seven, I think they're on the 7 line. I have a situation with the uh, American 11. What? I have a situation with American 11. Do you want to talk to Otis Tower? I want to talk to uh, Otis Drake. I need to scramble some uh, fighters. All right, well, hold on a second. Let me get you the soup. Let me pick up on the 41. Uh, something about a scramble. I don't know. Hey, Cape, uh, Dan Winnicott from Washington. Are you having a situation with American 11, the possible hijack? American 11? Yes, sir. The private boss went to LAX. Right now, he's stopped the Albany. He'd like to scramble some fighters to go tail him. Oh, okay. Well, we'll talk to Otis here. Okay, and uh, just put a, uh, if he wants, just depart, and uh, we'll put a flight plan. Kennedy. Here's a heads up for you here. I got an American 11. He's right over Kingston right now. He's, we think he's at flight level 290. There appears to be some possible problem with him. He departed Boston going to uh, Los Angeles. But uh, somewhere along the way here, he took a left turn. And he's not talking to anyone, hasn't talked to anybody in about 75, maybe 100 miles. But we're southeastbound right now, so you're going to pass just like over Carmel. And again, we don't have a verified altitude. We think he's a flight level 290. We're trying to verify that. You have now. a code on him? Uh, no, he's just playing x ray. He's, there's no code on the guy. He's playing x ray. And we can prove that. So he's a primary right now. Right over King right. now, flight level 290, supposedly. Supposedly 290, and he's headed southeastbound? He's headed southeastbound right now, like he's going to go between, uh, looks like maybe right over Dewey's intersection. So I'm just giving you a heads up. We're not talking to him. No one's talked to him about the last 20 minutes. And what's his call sign? American 11. American 11. American 11. Yeah, I'll, I'll call you when he gets on close to your boundary, okay? Okay. Okay, we're not showing anybody on the uh, TCAS. Uh, just a second. We're looking over there and see if we can spot him. Is there a doctor on board? Is there a doctor on board that he's <clears throat> you guys? You don't have any doctors on board, okay. So you've gotten all the first class passengers out of first class? Roger, Swepin, Sergeant Powell. Hi, right, Boston Center, Team U. We have a, a problem here. We have a hijacked aircraft headed towards New York, and we need you guys to, we need someone to scramble some F-16s or something up there to help us out. Is this, is this real world or exercise? No, this is not an exercise manifest. Okay, hey, uh, hold on one second, okay? Yes. Hey, 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 seriously, hey, 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 She did say that all the first class passengers have to move back to coach. So first class, the cabin is empty. What? Whoa. What was that? Not real world. Real world hijack. Cool. Real? Where is it? Sir. Sir. Boston? Sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, I've got an MCC coming in right now to talk to you so you can handle all that. Thank you. All right. Open line. Uh, yeah, Hunter is calling uh, in reference to the hijack aircraft. Yes. We're checking to get some information from you if we could. Okay, what, would you, what do you need? We need call sign type. Hi, this is Major Deskins. Hi, Joe Cooper, Boston Center. We yes, have sure. a hijacked aircraft headed towards the New York metro area. I'm wondering if you could um, send someone up there, some F-16s or something. 
can you help us out? Maybe out, of, okay. maybe out of Otis? Do you have a mode 3 on it? No, Do you have a mode three no code? it's just a primary target only. We lost um, we lost the uh, mode, mode C on it. So you'd have to get up in the air and we'd have to vector you towards the aircraft. Okay, so you'd want to control the intercept because... We have to, yeah, you until, have to, until right. you guys pick him up on primary radar. Okay, so you have a general location as to where he is? We're still tracking him right now. You're tracking him. Can, yeah. can you give can me you a lot long where you think he is just for RSA? Yeah, hold on a second. Boston to Los Angeles? That was his original destination, yeah. And we're looking for aspects of the intersection that long. Is there a real flag? You got it? You know, well, I'm Could I get New York Trade Card? You bet. So nothing with the uh, cockpit? Yes, with American 11. Say it again? Oh, a reference to American 11. Right, have you had any contact with him yet? Uh, no, no contact. Uh, it is confirmed uh, hijack, though. Hi. Okay. Hey, Tracon, hi, Boston Center, uh, good morning, it's American 11, uh, 767, possible hijack. Okay, American 11, 75, uh, and uh, Destin, where's he landing? Uh, right now, we don't have any idea, but uh, he was to the northwest of Albany, and now he's uh, down by Sparta, Newton Speed, okay. very rapidly. We believe he's the primary only, and... Uh, we believe he's on the descent. That's why he's uh, he's he's wow. slowing down. Tower is on. Approach is on. Sky killer. This is Huntress placing Panta four five four six on battle stations. I repeat, battle stations. Time one two four one. Authenticate. Hotel Romeo. All parties acknowledge with initials. Command post. Sky killer. SOC, Ray Holland. Ray Holland, Nancy Wyatt, uh, Boston Flight Service. Yes. Okay, we've got the flight attendants on the line here. You do have them on the line? On the plane, yeah. Can you conference them in with us? I have no idea how to do that. If you can help me out. Um, hold, uh, he's getting some information here. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to read his notes for you. Um, it looks like uh, he's Middle Eastern, he speaks no English, he was in 10B, 10 Baker, right. 9 D and G, speaks no, speaks no English, uh, the plane's in a rapid descent. Uh, Is the cockpit still? Yeah. Okay, the flight attendants are concerned they don't know what's going on in the cockpit. Are you in contact with them? No, we're not. That's true. We're, we're trying to get in contact with the cockpit. Okay. No, you'll feel like you're different. Okay. Uh, we don't really want to tell her that. Okay, don't. Okay. Okay, got it. Okay, they're, um, we're not sure. Um, okay, it looks like there is severe bleeding that, uh, okay. he's keeping them, keeping her on the line. Um, there's severe bleeding. There is a slashed throat. Michael, is that severe? Is that slashed throat a flight attendant? No. He's off about uh, 9 o'clock and just about 20 miles from here. It looks like he's heading southbound. But there's no transponder, no nothing. And no I've never seen so much real-world stuff happen during the next... Lat Long, we're showing the map. Lat Long, we're showing the map. The last... Uh, See, Lat Long, 41, right. What was that? Okay, okay. find this guy. Yeah. 41, and we're putting it in. 1443. 1443, look for it, right there. Okay, mode 3, 1443, last known. No, this is real world. Okay, run the high check. I got a Z point, sir. Last known position that we got out of this guy was right there at the Z point. He's heading 190 at 29,000 feet. He's heading down. So, we're looking for somebody. You know what, just start hitting up tracks all around that area, that Z point. Okay, just north of uh, SDMCC, scramble Otis. Copy, same mission. MCC, I don't yeah. know where I'm scrambling these guys to. I need a direction, uh, 
That's the nation. Okay, I'm going to give you the Z point. It's just north of uh, New York City. I got this lat long 4115-7436 or 7340. What's going on, Betty? Betty, talk to me. Betty, are you there? Betty? What do you think you lost her? Okay, so we'll, let, we'll stay open. We, I think we might have lost her. Okay. Kingston 93 line. Is that your point out yet? Not yet. Kingston 93 line, this is East Texas. Go ahead, sir. Can you turn that Delta 2433 a little bit to the right? They got the Eagle flight in there, the guy at 31 that they wanted to look at this American to see what altitude he was at. Can you put him on like a 290 and stop the Delta 1489 underneath? Yeah, well, we just put, we just put Delta 2433 on you, so we'll try him again if we All have right. We'll turn him to a 290, right? I'm not talking to the Delta. Oh, okay. All right. Delta 2433, New York. Go ahead. Turn right heading of 290, Delta 2433 vectors for traffic. Delta 2433 at 290. We'll pick up that ELC too, but it's uh, very... What's that? Boston Flight Service has another one of the flight attendants on the phone here. Boston Flight Service. Amy? You lost okay. it? Yeah, okay, we lost the other one, so I really need okay. to get on the phone with her. Something's wrong. Uh, it's Amy, Amy Sweeney's on the phone. Amy Sweeney? Yeah, she's the number nine. Okay. And he's having trouble talking to her right now. All right, these are the two that are injured. Amy? 25. She started screaming and saying something's wrong, and now he's having trouble. Okay. Now he thinks he might be disconnected. Okay. Well. Now is that? Fudge. Fudge, Fudge. There's a contract with an active air defense scramble for Santa 4546. Time one two four six. Authenticate Delta X ray. Scramble immediately. Panta four five four six. Heading two eight zero. Flight level two nine or zero. Contact Huntress on frequency two two eight decimal nine or backup three six four decimal two. All parties acknowledged with initials. Command post. Blake Bueller. Tower. J on the tower. Approach. Tango Juliet. Night killer. Uh, All parties are cleared to drop. Juliet Z point that we put on the scope. 29,000 heading 190. We're just gonna do. We're gonna try to find this guy. They can't find him. There's not. Um, there's been supposedly there's threats in the cockpit. So we're just uh, we're doing the thing. True. And probably right now with what's going on in the cockpit is probably really crazy. So that probably needs to. That will simmer down and we'll probably get some better okay. information. I have scrambled Otis already for your, your direction. We're sending them in that general direction. We're sending them right to that Z point and then we can uh, we can maneuver them as deem uh, right. We'll, we'll work with them. Make sure weapons work with them now. 1489, New York Center, Roger. Clear direct to pods down. Watch. Say again, if you lost uh, track of the aircraft, over. Boston has lost track, and on our frequency, we have confirmed that it was a hijack. That's on the tapes. Yeah, New York confirms we've lost the track as well, and we were uh, we got a report of an ELT in the area that the track was in. Kennedy Tower reports. Are you serious? Kennedy Tower reports that there was a fire at the World Trade Center. And that's, uh, that's the area where we lost the airplane. 
3.15, contact the New York Center on 134.6. Have a nice day. 134.6. Delta point 3.15, good. Do the same. Uh, it's 34.6. 34.6. Yeah, Three to five minutes. minutes. And you'll get there at 429, so leveling 350 space. I'm sorry, who was that? Yes, sir, 429, leveling 350. Ah, you'll 429, New York Center, Roger. Recycle your transponder, score code of 1470. United 175, New York. So, if we can find it, we'll intercept it. Did you just, you just said something hit the World Trade Center or something that reports? No, keep on going with it. Yeah. Talking with ID, and we had a phone call that came down to us saying that they had a possible hijack out of Boston. Okay. And uh, I just flipped around, and we were just, we, we always wanted for the news. And a 737 hit the World Trade Center. And I'm, I was just curious at the same time if that was the aircraft. Uh, last I knew, they had a primary on it, and the track was not squawking 7500, but it was uh, under duress. Send them to New York City still. Continue to go. Sure, hold on. Okay. Okay. You, who's plugged in up there? Plug in. I'm going to have to have you hold on. Okay. Up this is what I got so far. Okay. Okay. This is what we need. Okay. okay. Now okay. we do. Yes. This is what I got. You hear about that input with Possible news at 737 just hit the World Trade Center. This is real world. And we're trying to confirm this. Okay, continue taking the fighters down to the New York City area, JFK area, as best as you can. Make sure that the FAA clears the your route all the way through. Just do what we got to do, okay? Just press with it. Ten. Hello. Do you uh, see that United 175 anywhere? And do me a favor, you see that target there, the 3321 code at 335 climbing? Don't know who he is. But you got the US Air 583. If you need to descend them down, you can. Nobody, we, we have a hijack. We have some problems over here right now. Oh, you do? Yeah. So I want you to take him down into this area. Hold as needed. 
Whatever altitude they need to go for center to make that work is fine with me. That's the area I want them to go in hold, right in that little gap there. All right, this is what we're doing. We're taking them down to this area to hold for now. Whatever altitude center needs for them to do that is fine. But uh, is the weapons team should pass that. The fighters should be talking to center. They're going to pass that through the fighters, exactly what we want them to do. Now. Okay, now. Foxy? Yeah. No, no. Because if he's still airborne. Okay, right now. Quick anyway. If you can, hand the fighters over directly to FAA so they They're can still control. under FAA control. We're okay. never going to take them. Just take them all. You just work with them, coordinate with them. Sir, Fighter 3, go ahead. Yeah, I get a uh, report on over the radio of uh, a commuter plane hitting the World Trade Center. Is that uh, Nordo 76 still in the air? Don't know, but just stand by. Delta 2433, turn left to a heading of 170 now. I have traffic. I'm not really sure if it's good out of 32. Might be descending, might be climbing. I'm showing them at 31 right now. And 170 out of 2433. Yeah, 175. Do you read New York? Tell the 2433, um, can you climb to flight level 330? The traffic looks like he's descended back down to 31 now. Now we can go up. Okay, climb and maintain flight level 330, Delta 2433. Climb to 33, Delta 2433. 315, the traffic is now at your, well, if you're heading on the 200 heading, he's about your 2 o'clock and about 7, uh, looks like 30.6 descending. Uh, we have him in sight, sir. Delta 2315, roger. Yeah, he's in sight. Okay, you can maneuver as necessary to avoid that aircraft, sir. I do not know what he's doing. Delta 2315, any evasive action you need to take is approved. Delta 2315, can you tell me what kind of aircraft that is and whose company's? Rock. Delta 2315, can you tell me what kind of aircraft it is and whose company? Uh, he's going behind us, sir. I'm going to try to get a good look at him. Delta 2315. Yes, sir. 542, you see him there at 12 o'clock and 5 eastbound, 28 and 8. Affirmative. Uh, we got an RA on him. We're uh, level one here. Okay, you can, uh, yes, sir. 542, fly heading at 290 now, Raider Vectors for your climb. 290, yes, sir. 542. Delta 2315, he's behind you now. You can turn right to a heading at 280 and join the airway. Uh, yes, sir, and I uh, didn't get a good look at him, but it was a darker paint scheme. Okay, yes, sir, 542, can you tell who he is? Is that the guy that was right ahead of us? Yes, it is. Looks like a Dell there, fine to me. Okay, looks like a Delta 75. Thanks, Bob. Well, three hand off. American. Delta 45, maintain flight level 270 and contact New York, 13432. Yes, sir, 1621, 350. U.S. Air 1621, Indy Center, Roger. American 77, Indy. Indianapolis, uh, good morning, our Canada 579 with you, 350 for 390. Air Canada 579, Indy Center, Roger. American 77, Indy. American 77, American, Indy. 2B, uh, three heavies looking negative contact. Delta 2315, you can proceed direct to Modena on course. We're maneuvering to get out of his way, but uh, I concur with the guy. Go ahead. Oh, I'm sorry. I got some handoffs for you. We got some incidents going over here. Is the Delta 2433 going to be okay at 33? Yeah. I had to climb up for traffic of a United 175 that just took off out of a thing. We might have a hijack over here, two of them. And center, 583. Okay. So, Delta 2433, you okay? Yeah, coming back? Yeah, Delta 2433. Okay. Mm -hmm. And, uh... The Delta 1489 is coming to you also. Okay, radar. Delta 1489, contact New York Center now on 134.32. Delta 1489, 3432. Delta 2433, thank you for the help. That uh, United just took off, and we're not really sure what he's doing. He thought it was United 767, though. That's, uh, that's what it looked like. Thank you, Delta 2433. Flying at 270, join J75. Resume on navigation. Thanks for the climb. Rock. 5 0 Mike Juliet, maintain flight level 220. Out of 21 to 22, 
Okay. Yeah, the aircraft was light color with a dark tail. Okay. American Dispatch, Jim McDonald. This is Indianapolis Center. I'm trying to get a hold of American 77. Uh, Indy, hang on one second, please. What? Hang on one second, sir. All right. What are you trying to get a hold of? American 77. Okay. On frequency 120.27. 120.27. We weren't talking to him, and all of a sudden it's just, uh... Okay. All right, we'll get a home for you. All right. If American uh, 77, uh, Indy Center, how do you read? American 77, Indy Radio Check, how do you read? U.S. Air 542, um, did you say you thought it was a dark paint scheme? No, it was a light colored paint scheme with a dark tail. I thought it was a dark paint scheme. Okay, traffic. understood. U.S. Air 542, thank you, and I'm sorry I didn't the, the uh, line tune you in into him head on so, as quick as I could have. I, I was busy talking to the guy right in front of you. We could have joined up. Hey, Joe, you see 3321 code just southwest of Newark by about 15, 18, 20 miles. 15,000 descending. We're looking, hold on, southwest of Newark by about 15, 20. Don't see any. They were tracking him, made a hard left turn. He's descending pretty rapidly, and especially what just happened in there. I got somebody who keeps coasting, but it looks like he's going into one of the small amp points down there. No, this guy's a big boy. This guy's a big boy because he's leaving some big contrails. I'm trying to bring him up here to get you there. There he is right there. Hold on. I'm just out of 9,500, 9,000 now. Do you know who he is? We just, we just, we don't know who he is. We're just picking him up now. All right, heads up, man. It looks like another one. All right. Liberty South, guard to 88 line. Yeah. Talk of 580, climb him to 28. He's already switched over, though. You're talking to him. No, I'm not. Head. Talk of 580, contact New York. Check with you now. Do you know if anyone down there has done any coordination to scramble uh, fighter type airplanes? Do you think the airplanes in the area? No, we have several situations going on here. It's uh, escalating big, big time. And we need to get the military involved with us. Wow, what's going on? Just get me somebody who has the authority to get military in the air now. All right. I'll go tell them. 7,000. Talk of 580, New York. Center maintains flight level 280. 280. Thank you. CWA 885 maintains flight level 280. Contact New York 13432. 3432, good luck. Good one, Thanks. CWA 3 maintains flight level 270. 3 heavy living 26 or 270. Continental 211, uh, men's altitude flight level 260. Hey, what's Papa 260, Continental 211. The number 0, Mike Juliet maintains flight level 260. That's your final. 260, you're going to take that camera? 134.32. 342. Nice job, Mike Lee. Bye-bye. Oh, man, 5981, 15.3 for 175. Hogan, 5981, New York Center, roger. Would you try to answer your line? Yes, sir, go ahead. What time, sir? Can you look out your window right now? Yeah. Can you can you see God about four thousand feet about five east of your pole right now? Looks like he's Yeah, I see him. Did you see God look is he descending for the building also? He's descending really quick too, yeah. Well, that's twenty five hundred feet now. He just dropped eight hundred feet in like a, like one one sweep. That's that's another situation. Who what kind of airplane is that? Can you guys tell? I don't know, I'll read it out in a minute. Another one just hit the building. Wow. Wow. Another one, another one just hit it hard. Another one just hit the world side. The whole building just uh, came apart. Oh Holy smokes. All right. I guess you guys can be okay. busy. It was an M? You guys tried them and no response? No response. Lost radar, lost. Yeah, we have no radar contact. Tommy, it sounds like we're talking to New York, but there's another one aimed at the World Trade Center. There's another aircraft? The second one just hit the Trade Center. Okay. Yeah, we got to get to. We got to alert the military uh, uh, real quick on this. Uh. Do we know what type, Terry? 
So we just got that report from, uh, from New York Center. Alright, we're standing by. 15 left, Camelot 427. American 77, Indy. Tony, we're going to stop everybody. We're going to shut. We're going to shut Boston down. I suggest the same elsewhere. You're going to do what, Terry? We're shutting the airplanes down. We're not letting anyone go right now. Okay. That's a good move. Uh, we're waiting to hear from security. Hand off, nine one Bravo Zulu. Continental two eleven, maintain level two eight zero. I think an airplane just plowed into the city. I. They did. Uh, uh, the World Trade Center hit the top. No, the top. another one. We just saw another one do it. Another one? Yeah. Holy cow, that's two and uh, one just hit it a big an hour ago. Yeah, one just a moment ago. No shit. 1,000 climbing, 1, 7,000. Elizabeth from Nantes, Sector says hi. New York Center, are you there? Uh, 193, New York Center, Roger. Uh, I'll hop higher for you in just a moment. Roger. Cactus 193, can you guys see the city from behind you there? Uh, not anymore. Okay. It looks like the uh, World Trade Center is on fire. Yes, it's a Boeing 757 we think just flew into the air, into the building. Are you, you're not kidding, right? No, I'm not kidding. Oh, shit. Sure. Yes, sir. Cactus 193, climb and maintain flight level 280. Uh, flight level 280. Uh, pardon me, I'm just in shock. 280, Cactus, uh, whoever I am, 193. Cactus 193, Roger. Listen to CBS News on uh, 1210. They think it was a small twin. I, I hope so. We had air, several aircraft identified as a 757. Unbelievable. Is this a departure or an arrival? We don't know. We think it was a hijack. Tommy, Jerry, it's confirmed on that tape that they said we have planes. Where's the takeoff then, though? I don't even remember a 75 taking off for quite a while. Uh, we don't know where he came from, sir, actually. Um, we're really not certain. Taka 580, Taka, contact the New York Center, 134.32. What did you say, Taka 580? Good day. Go ahead. Uh, is there a way or to try to get messages to the airborne aircraft for increased secu uh, security for the cockpit or something, the A cars or something? Okay, Foxy, this is what this is what I foresee that we probably need to do. We need to talk to FAA. We need to tell them if this stuff's going to keep on going, we need to take those fighters, put them over Manhattan. Okay, sir. That's the best thing. That's the best play right now. So. Coordinate with the uh, FAA, no, tell them oh, if there's wild. more out there, but, uh, which we don't know, let's get them over Manhattan. At least we've got some a lot of traffic on this bridge. I, I copied that. Let's keep doing that. Uh, contact to the command center, the ATA rep. See if we can get the airline company operations to contact their aircraft. I'd recommend uh, maybe possibility of the stuff coming in from overseas, Bangor as an alternate site, but leave that up to them. No, we'll leave it up to them, but we're also going to let them know to increase the security for cockpit access. All right, uh, that sounds like a good plan. Hey, Kennedy, Coil 99. And uh, we watched it just after it happened, and it's been escalated and all that smoke, so I guess they haven't got it under control. Okay.
Water ski 5411, New York. Liberty West, Yardley 88. West. Uh, water ski 5411, put them on a 270 heading to oh, join. Sorry, and here them comes. 270 to join, please. Thank right. you. Continental 1167, uh, see your heading. 245. Continental 1167, Roger. Climb and maintain flight level 210. Up to 210, going 1167. Cactus 193, contact the New York Center 134.32. 134.32, Cactus 193. Center, good morning, water ski 50. Thank you, Alan. Thank you, This is Huntress placing quit. 2526 on battle stations. Time 1310. Authenticate Charlie Victor. That is quit. 2526 on battle stations. All parties acknowledge with initial. Command post. Langley. Tower. American dispatch, Jim McDonald. Indianapolis Center, did you get a hold of American 77 by chance? No, sir, but we have an unconfirmed report that the second airplane hit the World Trade Center. And it's Say again. You know, we lost American 11 through hijacking. So, you know, American was a, um, a Boston, Los Angeles flight. It was. All right. I can't really. I can't hear what you're Rapid saying there. You said American 11? Yes, we were hijacked. Which it was a Boston LA flight, and 77 is a Dulles LA flight, and um, we have an unconfirmed report a second airplane just flew into the World Trade Center. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Uh, Boston, good morning. Yes, 1168, checking in uh, 280. Yes, 1168, Boston Center, good morning. Did you copy advisory to heighten your cockpit uh, security and cockpit awareness? Uh, negative, to see again. This is 68 uh, all FAA facilities are advising all air carriers to heighten their cockpit awareness. There has been at least one hijack this morning and possibly two. Okay, USS 1168, Roger, we copy. And uh, just confirmed that was an airliner that crashed into the World Trade Center. And that's what we understand, the possibility of two. Okay, thank you, sir. Good, well, good morning. They said 2047 to be copied this. Yes, sir, what is Thank you. Boston Center, good morning. Since uh, Southwest 1029, flight level 320, uh, climb into 350, we copy all the reports. Southwest 1029, I checked. 660, uh, or what was the frequency? 1010. We're getting used on 980 and 1210. They, they think it might be two aircraft. Now, there is a lot of talk that we're, we had to, a couple of aircraft look like they got hijacked, and, and, uh, yeah, I, don't know. I know at least one of them hit the World Trade Center. We don't know what happened to the other aircraft. Maybe both of them went in. Yes, sir. We're listening at 660. Two different plane crashes. Uh, one uh, swept wing jet type airliner. And we were talking to the last controller. He said he was tracking one at over 500, 500 knots going into the city. Yeah, that's the one that hit the World Trade Center. Elmira, you can be able to take that guy. I gave Phil Crimmel air until I'll take him around, by the way. United 1211, with 11 11 United 1211, Eric Center, Roger. And uh, did, you, did you still want us on a 3280 uh, heading for United 1211? United 1211, clear direct to Phillipsburg. Resume nav, climb and maintain for level 260. Okay, 260, direct Phillipsburg on nav, uh, United 1211. Center United 1141 is with you passing a 15,000 for 17,000. Sorry, I got hung up on the line there. Who's calling? That was United 1141 passing a 152 for 17,000. United 1141 here, Center Roger.
Vector 956, contact Cleveland Center, 133.07. 3307, Vector 956, hold on. Thanks. Air Shuttle 5768, traffic at 1 o'clock, 10 miles westbound to 31. Oh, Roger, Lincoln 5768. Frontier 575, traffic at 10 o'clock and 8, northbound at 33. Uh, 575, we're looking. Count out of 428, uh, turn right heading at 330, join J60, resume navigation. 330, join J60, normal nav, count out of 428, thank you. Count out of 428, climb and maintain flight level 350. Maintain 350, count out of 428. United 1141, climb and maintain flight level 310. Command Center East. Boston, listen, uh, both of these aircraft departed Boston, both for 7-6s, both heading to L.A., and I'm looking out on the TSD, and I think that all departures out of Boston should have heightened cockpit security. Is there any way you can bring up every center in the country and relay that message so that they can tell the aircraft that are uh, out there flying right now to increase the cockpit security vigilant on this day? I'll get the message out. Thank you very much. The Sage 3 arrival. Find and maintain flight level 310. Okay, for United 1211, we have uh, Phil's Clerk J160, Iowa City, J10, uh, North Platte, State 3310, and uh, we clerk Fund 310 at the time. Affirmative, climb and maintain flight level 310, United 1211. 310, United 1211. Are you able to confirm anything within your airline to us? No. Uh, unfortunately. Uh, how, how about can you tell me if we know for sure it was American 11 that went into the trade center? We think not? that's who it was. Okay. And we're missing another flight also. Uh, what flight are you missing? 77. And, and when was the last time you knew for sure something about him? Uh, he was in, um, wait a minute. Well, there's, uh, I don't know how he got up there, but there's they think 77 blocking, is up there also. Okay. And he's, he's out of Dulles. I, uh, okay, and? Dulles, L.A., and they both uh, apparently have been hijacked and 11 and we're pretty sure is in, the, in there and and uh, 77 we were talking to him uh, according to indianapolis center about uh -huh. 45 minutes ago uh -huh. and uh, in indy center uh -huh. and i don't know how he got to, to uh, back to the trade center i have no idea if, if, if that happened okay it may not have we have another call sign of course we don't know for sure any of these call signs right now uh -huh. but if we find that it's your aircraft, we'll certainly give you a call. Okay. So right. you you have uh, you have two airplanes in the Trade Center. Yes. And uh, you don't know who either one of them are for sure. Yeah, that's true. Okay. If I did, I would share it with you. Okay. Thanks. So. All right. Bye, Bill. Okay. U.S. Air 1753, contact Cleveland Center, one three three point zero seven. 133.07, and Middletown 66 Imperial. U.S. Area 1197. Climb and maintain flight level 280. Airway 147 to Maisie, and then direct Philly. That's what we got, thank you, sir. Okay, Navy JT 753. Andy. Hey, Andy, there's Pat's command center. Need you to tell me anything and everything you can about American 77, where he is, and if you have radar or not. Well. Okay, I'm listening to my ops manager talk to Washington. I'm sorry? We were talking to him in the vicinity of uh, Henderson. Henderson? What's Henderson? Hang on, hang on a second. Uh, 
Okay. We, uh, I guess we were talking to him in the vicinity of Henderson, HNN. We lost communications and radar with him. Hang on a minute. I'm going to have the, the ops manager tell you the story. Hello, Command Center. Yes, sir. This is John Thomas, Ops Manager. I think we need to let everybody know this right away if they don't already. American 77 was over, uh, was just west of Charleston, West Virginia, at flight level 350. It's a heavy, heavy Boeing 752 and disappeared off our radar scope about 1256Z along with lost uh, frequency. We were treating it as the law started to do some procedures to notify search and rescue and whatnot when uh, American Airlines told us they'd had some aircraft or an aircraft hijacked. We now believe that aircraft may have been hijacked, although no one has, you know, we have nothing to verify that. What with the World Trade Center, we could have another loose aircraft out there somewhere. Okay, but at the time of loss, do you, uh, what altitude was he at? Flight, flight, level, flight level 350. And he just lost primary also? Lost all, yes, lost no primary or uh, that we could see. Of course, we don't, wouldn't necessarily be able to pick up a primary there anyway. But okay, and I'm assuming then that you're uh, uh, doing what you can to do a primary re retrack on him, if you can do that from yes. the team. Sure. And then, uh, so 1256 Zulu, we lost pr comm and radar. Any uh, ELT? No ELTs. Um, okay. Uh, any more information you get, I appreciate it, and I'll forward this immediately up to the NOM and everybody that's standing up there. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Military Boston Center just had a report that American 11 is still in the air and it's on its way towards heading towards Washington. Okay, American 11 is still in the air. Yes, it was, was evidently another aircraft that hit the tower. That's the latest report we have. Okay. I'm going to try to confirm an ID for you, but I would assume he's somewhere over uh, either New Jersey or okay. somewhere further south. Okay, so American 11 isn't a hijack at all then, right? No, he is a hijack. He, American 11 is a hijack. Yes. And this he's going into Washington? This could be a third aircraft. Okay, third aircraft hijack heading towards Washington. No. Okay, uh, American Airlines is still airborne. 11, the first guy, he's heading towards Washington. Okay, I think we need to scramble Langley right now, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take the fighters from Otis and try to chase this guy down if I can find him. Yeah. You sure? Okay, he's heading towards Langley, or I should say Washington. American 11, the original guy, he's still airborne. We're still doing it, still getting a, we're getting a position. Got, like, uh, got a position? A couple hijacks on the go, real world. Got to go. All right, uh, they are. Okay. Foxy, scramble Langley, head him towards the Washington area. Roger that. Could be American. Hold on a second. We're trying to get a code on this guy right now. We do have a tail number. It's a. Oh, we're. It's uh. What was the tail number? November three three four Alpha Alpha. If we can find him, we we're getting we're trying to get we're, we're trying to get the mode. Morning, Cleveland. It's United 93 with you at 350. Uh, some light stop here at 35. Any ride reports? Uh, no, just a uh, little light shop. Nothing worse than that. United 93.
Securities uh, acknowledge with initials. Langley Command Post. Langley Command Post. Heading 010, primary 2, decimal 6, decimal 2, 3, 4, 364, decimal 2. Okay, no, Kodesh copy. Mike, Jack, killer copy. If you have any questions, just give me a call. Five, four, six, zero by two, F-O by two, by gun, three tanks. Into a tail chase on this American. Let me give you another heading towards Washington. Three tanks, affirmative. Plus, I have uh, more aircraft available to me if I need it from the software. Okay. Also, I have a tanker, main eight five. Okay, got tanker. I have additional tankers out of McGuire. KC tens. Team call sign. I'm not sure on the, the numbers. 2-2 two, two, and 2-3, two, two KC-10s. I'm sticking them in uh, Whiskey 107. Yeah, and did you get the word that I, Langley got scrambled? Go ahead, sir. Yes. Okay, we yeah. couldn't find the position on the We just got now. scrambled about uh, two minutes ago. No, that's... I'm sorry, take up to Medix 150. Yeah, Medix 150, and you, uh, uh, they are taking the Philadelphia traffic right now, uh, whatever's airborne, uh, as, as long as they can. So uh, hopefully we'll be able to get you in there. All right, great, thanks, appreciate it. But you may still want to talk to your company and see what the alternate plans are. They, I don't know if you heard about the accident in the, uh, the New York. Yeah, we just uh, turned on the ADF to try to find out. Sounds pretty serious out there. Uh, yeah. Northwest 238, Cliff. Cleveland Center, Jet 956, level 390. Jet 956, 390, Roger. United 636, you going to direct Knox now? That's affirmative, United 636. Yeah, 636, Cliff. Lorraine Patterson, 899. Patterson, maybe not. Lorraine Patterson, maybe not. United 1523 traffic at uh, 2 o'clock to 3 o'clock, 4 miles eastbound, flight level 370. Let's say United 1523. United 93, that traffic for you is 1 o'clock, 12 miles eastbound, 370. Negative contact, we're looking at United 93. Lorraine Patterson, maybe not. Lofton, Kilo 9. Tag 5-1, Cleveland. That's block for an 89. Are you watching the tag 5 1 out there? I guess they're going to have a right turn back. We'll, we'll, have to re- we'll just put them in back to St. Louis and they can put in whatever they want just so we can get them off back. Marine. 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 Yeah, the if uh, Air Canada continues his climb, can you take him climb to 35 or 39? Uh, uh, doesn't look 30, like it. Uh, doesn't look like it. All right. good. All right. Thanks. Somebody call Cleveland. Carter, back in the 1060 with you, we're 370, we're uh, slowing uh, due to the um, delays possible going, uh, going eastbound. That's American 1060. Lorraine, Patterson, do you have that line? Carter, American 1060. Yeah. You got United 93. United 93, yeah. Descended. Lorraine Patterson, United 
I just say it looked like you just send it there. So. United 93 verified 350. We don't know where it is, though. It's headed towards Washington was the last known information. Washington better get on the Right. And I don't know, but somebody's got to get the president going. <laughs> this is not good. They better start looking for this guy. Uh, we, yeah, we just sent up. I'm not going to say too much right now, but uh, I want to give you a heads up. Um, do you have any information, though, where American 1 1 is or anything? See, this guy, they, Boston is the only one giving us any kind of decent okay. freaking input. Just want to just want to say one more thing, too. Uh, Washington, I don't know if they don't think this is serious or not, but they are not, unless they hear from, like, the centers. If you could give them a heads up and let them know that this is Washington Center. Um, they're not really, not at all. Okay, sir? We've got to get a point out on that American Airlines. Boston, they got him? Washington right now. I don't know if he's on him yet. Well, vice versa, I just talked to them. And I'd have the president airborne, wherever. What's up? Uh, Boston has no clue where they are, and he's going to let Washington Center know that this is very serious. Good. Because nobody's actually yeah, serious in there. So, hey. I get our lat long. Anybody good at math? Take our lat, last lat long, and they were doing 290 knots. Did you get the third? Headed towards Washington. The Z point. That was the American Airlines one. No, our first, our first Z point. Yeah, that was the American Airlines. That was our lat long on him. Okay, stand by, please. Okay, it looks like I have everyone on here except Boston Center. This is uh, the Air Traffic Command Center, the TMO on duty in the West Area. I need to have all traffic management units do an inventory, basically an inventory of all airborne traffic. Ensure that you do not have any unusual situations or any aircraft that are not accounted for. If you have any unusual situations or unaccounted for aircraft, identify them and contact us here at the Nine fifty six. Uh, who's that calling? Executive 956. Executive 956, go. Oh, we're just answering your call. Uh, we did hear that uh, yelling, too. Okay, thanks. Yeah, we're just trying to figure out what's going on. Okay, I'm here. I got the piece to down. Keep remaining to ding. We have a ball on board. So it's uh, uh, Calling Cleveland Center, you're unreadable. Say again slowly. Huntress ID, unsecure line. Huntress ID, this is Washington Center, the operations manager. Uh, Go ahead, sir. Okay, I guess you had called here a couple times. You never talked to me, but if there's anything you need or anything I can help you with, let me know what it is right now, please. Okay. Um, do you want me to let you know what we have going on, sir? I would, yes. Well, okay. I have a pretty good idea, but yes. Okay, the three aircraft missing out of Boston. I just spoke at Boston, and they said that they're not sure of the third aircraft call sign, but they do have two. One of them is United 175. Uh -huh. The other one is American 11. Right. They thought that the American 11 was the aircraft that crashed into the World Trade Center with the United 175. However, American 11 is not the aircraft that crashed. He said the pilot on American 11 was talking to him, having a rough time telling him what's going on. There was threats in the cockpit being made. This was the initial uh, hijack information that we got, American 11767 from Boston to Los Angeles. Proposed route, he was headed towards JFK at the time that they lost contact, but that was not the aircraft headed uh, into the World Trade Center that hit it. Okay. That's what Boston's saying. He, the last known, and I'm not sure where we heard it through the grapevine people calling, is that American 11 was headed towards Washington, and that's the only aircraft. thing. Was headed toward where? Washington. Okay. So your AOR, and I just wanted to give you a heads up. Okay. The last, yep. Okay, go ahead. The last known lat long that we had, primary target only was 4038 North. 07403 West. Executive 956, that aircraft we believe was transmitting is 12 o'clock, 5 miles. Turn left heading 225, I'll get you away from them. Bluffton 956. 16 Mike Fox, drop by heading 120 to get you away from that. 120, I'm heading Mike Fox. 561 Alpha Charlie, fly heading 090. 090, 1 Alpha Charlie. Roger, American 1060, fly heading 090. 090. Approach. Hey, this is Douglas Approach Control.
Patrol. We're tracking a fast-moving primary heading towards the White House. The White House has been advised. All right, I'll tell them. Okay. Yeah. United 93 may have a bomb on board. Okay, United 93, who's speaking? The Cleveland Center. Okay, Cleveland. What's his uh, origination and destination? He's out of Newark out of Newark going to San Francisco. His position is 2015 East. Actually, he's farther than that. He's east of Dreyer. His exact position is 30 miles east of Dreyer. Okay, you have a transponder on this aircraft, or did he go primary? At this time, he's uh, code 1527, and we still have a transponder. Okay, and can you give me any additional information as to why you believe there may be a bomb? Uh, because he's screaming that on the frequency. Okay, very good. Thank you. Anyone else? All right, I'm just connecting now. We just had another report. United 93, who was in Cleveland Center's airspace somewhere around Dyer Intersection, just reported that they heard screaming on the frequency and the people have a bomb on board. The aircraft departed Newark en route to San Francisco was the report. You know what type? Uh, no, don't have that information. Okay, we're still tracking it now, right? Correct. We're still tracking at this time. Okay. Thanks, Coach. All right. Patrick ID is coming out. Can I help you? Uh, latest report. Aircraft VFR six miles southeast of the White House. Six miles southeast of the White House? Yep. East. He's moving away. Southeast of the yep. White House? Aircraft is moving away. Moving away from the White House? Yeah. Okay. But what? He was a DVFR? We we believe just we just know it's a VFR aircraft. We're not sure who it is. Uh, if you want to hold on a second. Okay. Copy. Have people down there looking. Okay. Copy. Our question here is, our, our aircraft that we have has climbed, turned, and is not talking to us. Gopher 06, traffic is 11 o'clock and 5 miles northbound, fast moving, type and altitude unknown. Are you have the traffic, do you know what kind it is, can you see? Looks like a 757, sir. A 757, can you estimate his altitude? Uh, looks like he's at no altitude right now, sir. Gopher 86, thank you. I came from Boston? Oh, we're going to turn and burn and crank Six it up. Miles. All right, here we go. This is what we're going to do here. Miles east of the White House right now. The monster march. Okay. He's what happened? Traffic for Gopher 06 is still in a descent now, and uh, looks like he's rolled out northeast now. All right, thank you. So on, so on, anyone? Go for 86, climb and maintain. Uh, you got a military? Yeah. Stand by. Go for 86, turn right and follow the traffic, please. Go for 86, turn right, hitting 080. We're going to back to you for the traffic. Okay, 080, go for 06. It's going. Dallas, I'm keeping. Go for 86. I'm 06 with me for a while. Okay, that's what you have? No, 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 sir. On the the one that was six miles southeast of the White House? Yes, southwest. Southwest? Yes, southwest. Okay, southwest of the White House. Was he a DVFR? Or you don't have any codes on him, but was he an actual deviating aircraft? Well, we believe he, I guess they believe now he might have just been a deviating aircraft. You believe that he's a deviating aircraft? Yeah. Okay, copy. Get more out of Washington to it from Okay, copy. Okay. Copy. Just pass the information. And uh, roll okay. that right turn to a 270 heading. Right turn to 270, Mike Fox. Right 561 Alpha, 561 Alpha Charlie, make a right turn to a heading of 270. Right turn 270, one off Charlie. Off Charlie, right. And, uh, Washington, this is Gopher 06. Gopher 06, guys. Yes, sir, that aircraft is down. He's in our 12 o'clock position. Uh, looks like it's just to the uh, north west of the airfield at this time, sir. Gopher 86, thank you. Descend and maintain 2000. Okay, we're down to 2000. And uh, this is Gopher 06. It looks like that aircraft crashed into the Pentagon, sir. Go for 86. Go for 06. Thank you. Understand you still want go for 06 to send to 2000, sir. Go for 06. You can maintain 3000 and uh, turn left heading 270. Okay, left turn to 270. Go for 06. Uh, any chance we can circle around the Pentagon, sir, on our 270 turn? Go for 06. Approved as requested. Go for 06. Go for a 06, okay, they're asking if you would go ahead and move away now towards the west, 270 heading, and uh, 2,000 for now. Roger, uh, we're climbing to 3,000, sir, and it uh, looks like that aircraft is impacted the west side of the Pentagon. All right, thank you. Okay. We'll call him super to get there. You need to be. I don't care how many windows you break. 
finally out in West Virginia at 386. Why'd they go out there? Because the guy pushed out of there. God damn it. Okay. Yeah, just push him. Yeah, uh, I think it'll be 6, 6, 6, 9, 86. 6, 6, 9, 86, right. Hi, uh, Captain. Uh, we'd like to do all the remaining details. We have uh, one report and are going to back to the airport and have our demand to remain quiet. Okay, it's United 93 calling. Yes, sir. Delta 1989. Okay, give me that. Delta 1989. Okay, type aircraft. Type aircraft? Yes, sir. Code? Can I give you a code? Yes, give me the code. 1304, presently what? due south of Cleveland. Okay, presently due south of Cleveland. Heading westbound, destination Las Vegas. Heading westbound, destination Las Vegas. And is this going to hijack, sir? We believe it is. You believe it is? Are they going to squawk hijack? I don't know. I don't know. It's just squawking 1304 now if you want to try to track him up. Okay, I'm type aircraft is what, sir? Yeah, uh, can you type aircraft on that Delta? Delta 1989, I think he's on there. 767? 767. And, and altitude? Yes, please. 350? 350, okay, copy that. And where, where did he take off out of, sir? He took off out of Boston. Boston? Yeah, okay. we'll try to get you a tail number on that if you want to get someone up there. All right, copy okay. that. Do you have any chance to know uh, souls on board? Uh, no, we don't have that information. You don't have any of that? There you Copy that. that. Thank you, sir. Okay. Do you want me to have it? I'm going to make Bye. We're going to try to get you a tail number. Okay, okay. thanks. Right, bye. bye. To the east, east just turned to the east also. American 1060, fighting 160. 160, American 1060. American 1060, Hello. roger. 16 Mike Fox drop to fly hitting of uh, 350. Uh, 561 Alpha Charlie, fighting 350. 351 Alpha Charlie. Roger. Delta 1060 and executive 956, we just lost the target on that aircraft. Okay, 956, we had a visual on it, this stand by. You have a visual on it? United now? 93, we spoke about him before. Yes. He is reversing course over Akron. They just lost his transponder. He's heading eastbound. What kind of airplane do we know yet? Uh, just a second. 757. Thanks, buddy. The aircraft is descending. Okay, we, yeah, he is descending. Correct. Heard that and then everything's being shut down. Yep. Baltimore has it. Okay, uh, National, are you up? Uh, no, I'm up now, Becky. Are you in a tower? Yes. yes. What's going on? Uh, there's a 737, I think it was, crashed into the Pentagon. Andy Center. Uh, Indianapolis Center, uh, reference Delta 89. Do you know any information about that aircraft? I wanted to give you a heads up. This is another hijack aircraft. Uh-huh. Boston to Las Vegas. He's on a mode 3 of 1304. We do have contacts. And what was the number again, Delta? Delta 89. It's a 767 out of Boston, heading uh -huh. to Vegas, and he's on a mode 3 of 1304. I have an exact lat long if you need it. Go ahead. Lat long. Look at Delta 89 quick. Go ahead. 421 North, uh -huh. 08215 West. Okay. And just to give you a heads up, that's all we have right now, but he is confirmed hijacked. Okay, we're not showing him in our system at this point. You are tracking him, you say? We have him on the radar, sir, but he is headed your way. He is headed our way. Delta 8-9. Okay. Off Boston to LAS, right? LAX. LAX? I've got, I've got Vegas, sir, whatever Vegas is. Oh, LAS, okay. Las Vegas. Okay, because we're not showing him in the system anywhere. Okay, he's on a, do you have like mode 3 capability or anything? He's on a 1304 code? Correct, correct. Okay, we'll bring that up. All right, sir. Okay, thanks. No, no. He's at he's at twenty eight thousand feet, three hundred ninety six knots. Still blocking his code. Still blocking. Yeah, it looks like he's by Toledo. By Toledo, so it doesn't look like he's landing. No. Okay. Now he's at twenty seven thousand feet. He's at twenty seven. Yeah. Oh, then he is. Sir. Yes. Uh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Where would he be right now if he was uh, going to be landed in Cleveland? Would he be descended? 
He would be descended now. He would be descended and, and speed would be slowing. Speed would be slowing. Well, it looks like he's not going to go there. It doesn't look like he's going to Cleveland. Nope. Okay. Yep. Okay, my aircraft by the White House is now near the Pentagon. I don't know where the hell they're getting there until I said Washington is no clue when I called Washington about it. They didn't know what the hell was going on. One center dollar nineteen eighty nine. One six Mike Fox contact Cleveland one one nine or point uh, three two. Nineteen thirty two, sir. Roger. Cleveland dollar nineteen eighty nine. Dollar nineteen eighty nine, go. Company wants us on the ground in Cleveland. Uh, say again. Uh, the company wants us to divert uh, to land at Cleveland. Uh, double nineteen eighty nine, Roger. Fire present heading. Descend and maintain potable three three zero. Expect further uh, vectoring for okay. Cleveland. Delta 1989, 330, present heading. Delta 1989, roger. And uh, contact Cleveland, 119.32. 1932. Uh, 16 Mike Fox, back with you. No answer, 1932. Uh, tell him, uh, try again, uh, Mike Fox. He was busy there. Uh, one one nine or point three two. Okay. We believe that aircraft is about hundred miles southeast. If you now southeast bound. Okay, United ninety three. Go ahead. Is twenty nine miles out of uh, twenty nine minutes out of Washington D C. Twenty nine minutes out of Washington D C. And tracking towards that. This is the one who reversed cars in Ohio. Yes. Go ahead. That's all I have. Next scan 881, Roger. Contact Cleveland 119.32. 1932. 1932. Okay. United 93, Cleveland. Do you still hear the center? United 93, do you still hear Cleveland? Peter, I'm turn to Toronto. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, Cleveland Air Canada 560, uh, we just got a message. Uh, operations would like us to turn around and go back to Toronto. Air Canada 560, I uh, understand that. Uh, stand by a second. I'm turning away from this guy and then back to Dunkirk. Okay. Air Canada 560, fly heading 290, expect direct Dunkirk, direct land. United 93, United 903, do you hear Cleveland? Talking to the medics, I see him turn okay. him out of the United yeah, Way. Yeah, United. Put your primaries up, Bill, because I'm pretty sure that's him. It's tracking I got, about five I got him on the track. Okay. 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 The uh, United 93 is 29 minutes out of where? Uh, he's heading towards the Washington area. He has. He was at flight level 350. He turned around at Akron, Ohio, and is tracking toward the Washington area at this time. Number 561 Alpha Charlie, contact Cleveland, 119.32, sir. 1932, good day. Good. United 93, United 93, Cleveland. All right, they're pulling Jeff away to go talk about United 93. Uh, do we want to think about uh, scrambling aircraft? Oh, God, I don't know. Uh, that's a decision somebody's going to have to make probably in the next 10 minutes. 
uh, you know, everybody just left the room. Allegheny? Allegheny. I believe that to be the primary associated with the United 93, if you want to put your primary buttons on there. I got the primary buttons on. Okay, you want to just take the hand off in case he calls you or calls somebody down that area? Okay, I'll do that. Uh, he's not answering me anymore. Right. Okay. And we don't know what altitude he's at. So. Okay. Okay, we put it out to Imperial and everybody below. All right. All right. United 93, United 93, do you hear Cleveland Center? Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, go ahead, Light. Yeah, point of air can five six six Dunkirk. That's uh, approved. Yeah. Exit 956, Cleveland.
Whiskey Sierra. Hey, 510 Whiskey Sierra. Whiskey Sierra, 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 Here he's coming. United 93 is two zero miles northwest of Johnstown. Two zero miles northwest on primary? Uh, well, that's a report from another aircraft. Off the nine. Hey, yes. reference at Delta 1989. Yes. Um, Cleveland talked to them. They talked to the pilot. He's not declaring emergency, but they're going ahead. I mean, in the hijack, they're going to go ahead and land him at Cleveland for precautionary measures. He's not a hijack. On the we got, uh, well, here's the deal. Uh, the one that was nine, backwards, the two birds that was they, they, just, they just did a quick turn. They got no weapons. They just went on a straight run up, up to the range. They blew all their load. I know, but we got two. They're loitering, and we're going to send them down to do an investigation. Two from Suffrage are airborne already. I got two more from Toledo. This, that special track's over uh, the, what do you call it? Over the lake right now. So, what are we going to do with it if it isn't? What are we going to do? i got to give my guy's direction. United 93 yes. was waving his wings as he went past the, v the VFR aircraft. They don't quite know what that means. 
rocking his ring wings. Ravenna, Appleton, Northwest 464. Ravenna, Appleton. Ravenna, Appleton. Hi, Hunter ID calling. I wanted to give you a heads up on the Delta Airlines 1989er that was in Cleveland Center, the OR. He was giving you the information that he was a hijacked aircraft. He is not a hijacked aircraft. He's taken precautionary measures and he's landing at Cleveland Center. However, we do have four fighters launched on that aircraft, just to be sure.
I'm just waiting for Delta 1989. Go ahead. Okay, well, uh, disregard that. Uh, um, did you... What we found out is that he was not a confirmed hijack. Okay, no, no, no. I, I don't want to even worry about that right now. Uh, we got a United 93 out here. Are you aware of that? United that has a, we've got three more hijacked airborne. That has a bomb on board. A bomb on board. And this is confirmed. Do you have a mode 3, sir? No, we lost this transponder. We have a bomb on board, um, Boston. What we want to know is, did you scramble airplanes for that Delta 8 in 1989? We did, out of Selfridge and Toledo, sir. Did you? Did you? Are they in the air? Yes, they are. Is there any way we can get them to where this United is? There is a report of black smoke in the, in the last position I gave you. 15 miles south of Johnstown. Uh, from the airplane or from the ground? Uh, they're speculating it's from the aircraft. Okay. Uh, who, it, it hit the ground. That's okay. what they're, that's what they're speculating. It's speculation right. only. Okay. Getting a preliminary report that United 92 hit the ground about 15 miles south of the ground. Fifteen twenty seven mode three. We got a track number? Fifteen twenty seven mode three. We got a track number? Okay, we got a mode three on this uh United ninety three. How close are you? Yeah, I'm just writing it down so you Three nine five one north. Zero seven eight four six west. Got it. I just got off with the phone with the colonel saying he has one E3 that was on its way out here that he understood that they got caught with a country of four zero. Toledo was look for him. Okay, I need a track number. Okay. Hey, Dean. Weapon? Okay, two air, two, apparently the United Nations will be airborne bomb on less than 20 minutes. Near Pittsburgh. Mode 3, 1527. Any weapons? We don't know. We'll press with that. We have anybody committed on the, one, the aircraft with the bomb on it? We're getting to it. We don't know where it is. We're, we're getting track on it. Just class weapons. Yeah. Okay. Got it. United 9-3, mode 3, Negative, negative clearance to shoot. Jamie. 1527, Brian. God damn it. <laughs> Foxy. I'm not really worried about code words. Specifically. Fuck the code words. That's perishable information. Negative clearance to fire. ID type tail. Hey, let your guys know also the white house. I'm doing uh, well, as good as uh, can be expected. Uh, I've got guys that will be launching in about 15 minutes. Appreciate it. Are they loaded? We've got hot guns. That's hot all guns? I've got. Well, that, that's good enough for me for the time being. Only words i got, i got another possible aircraft with a bomb on board. 
It's in uh, Pennsylvania, York, Proxima area. Yeah, that's south. Yeah, south of us. And there's also the possibility of another one that's possibly at Cleveland area. Okay. Pittsburgh. Do we have vectors on those? Not yet. It's like one is the one over Cleveland turned around, looks like he's heading back. The guy down at York, Pennsylvania, he's heading at north northwest. Okay, we might be able to get those two. Yeah. And the call sign for the guy in York is United ninety three, mode three of fifteen twenty seven. Okay, it doesn't help us. We can't adjust yeah, it. I got okay, and I got this other guy out west. He's American. Where's that guy? Practice over Cleveland. Okay, I got one who just faded over Cleveland. Delta eight niner, mode three. I don't know it's not going to help you, but if you're talking to FAA, they might be able to help you. 1304. Okay, when we get our guys airborne, they're going to contact you on 260.9. Uh, I've got two jets right now. Do you need more than two? Can you bring up two more? Get four to them. Yep. Yeah. Okay, thank you, sir. And if you want to talk to Colonel uh, Colonel Marr, he's up at 6403, sir. Thank you. I don't I also want to give you a heads up, Washington. Go ahead. United 9-3, have you got information on that yet? Yeah, he's down. He's down? Yes. When did he land? Because we he, have confirmation. He, he, did, he did not land. Oh, he's down? Yes, yeah, somewhere up northeast of Camp David. Northeast of Camp David. That's the, that's the last report. They don't know exactly where. Yeah.